you, darling. Why are you doing this? Well, we have to separate the dark skins from the light ones. Why? Well, because the company pays us more money for the dark ones. You mean the dark ones are better? Yes, that's right. An animal with dark skin is usually more valuable. Rex, I guess you're not worth much, because you have light skin. <laughs> Maybe you want out. Maybe. Hello there. Hello. What are you doing up here? My Uncle Alan brought me. Hello, Dad. Hello, honey. What's Alan doing up here? Come on, Judy. I want you to go in the bedroom now. Huh? Do I have to go to bed again? No, I want you to just stay like home. All right. Come on, Rex. Dad, huh? where have you been? Where have I been? Why, you knew, treading with little shoes. Alan come up alone? No, there was a patrol with him. They'd been looking for the men who held up the Arctic Queen. The Arctic Queen? Didn't you know? Well, how could I know? Answer me, Dad, please. Of course not. Say, what are you getting at, honey? Dad, have you ever seen these? Well, these are NTC pelts. I know. They were stolen from the Arctic Queen, and Alan found them in our storage cabin. Our storage cabin? Why, how did they get there? Well, that's what I'm trying to find out. Joyce, you don't think I had anything to do with that holdup, do you? I swear I don't know how those pelts got in there. I know you didn't, Dad. We'll explain everything to Alan when he gets back down. He's with Hard Sack and Young. Well, what are you doing back here? McMillan, I arrest you for possession of property stolen from the Arctic Queen and being an accessory in the murder of Jim Montgomery. Having heard the charge, you are not bound to say anything. But whatever you say hereafter will be used as evidence against you at your trial. But you can't arrest him. He had nothing to do with it. I promised Alan that Dad would be here when he got back, and he will be. With all this evidence, Sergeant Baker should have left a man here to arrest your father. He knew he wouldn't run away. He promised me that... I'm not interested in what Sergeant Baker promised you, but I'm sure the inspector will be. You can explain that to him. I won't let you take him. Oh, I'm... Boys, better I go along. I've had nothing to do with it, so there's nothing to be afraid of. All right, Constable. I'm sorry, Miss McMillan. I'll have to take these along. If you don't mind, we'll need them for evidence. <laughs> 